Hey up, welcome back to our channel. I am James and this oh wait. What do we do this now? I don't know, I just forgot. And if we start I don't this. know, I just forgot I thought we could do it. Um, today's episode is a bit different because I didn't say that we were going to do a vlog. We did do quite a bit, but we're like... Oh, are you scrapping that? I'm, I'm, well, I've still got it, but I'm like, we didn't really do... Well, <laughs> do anything. I don't want to do it just for the sake of it, so that will come maybe... Never. But we've got the push push Um Today, we're going to do something we want to do for a long time. It's a Q&A, get to know us, because we're like, we've done a... I don't know how many videos, seven, seven months worth of videos. Oh. And we've not answered your questions. And these have come from Instagram. And I feel like I forgot to take some from the YouTube channel. <laughs> because I asked, you, I asked about a month ago. Mm. We'll what, try and think as we go well, we what you might want to Yeah, do. we're going to go on a tangent probably. <laughs> so do you want to start? Or shall I ask the questions? I don't mind. No. Yeah, well, I'll... You decide everything. Right? I'll just do everything. I'll just do everything. Uh, how did we meet? By my answer. Well, no, but how did we meet? I don't know. I think you were the instigator of us meeting. We met on Grinder, mm -hmm. which is a dating app for those of the heterosexual persuasion. Not heterosexual persuasion. No, but they might not know. No. If you're heterosexual, you won't know what grammar is. Yeah, so it's not for the heterosexual persuasion. I thought said that. Yeah, you said it's not... It's, no, you said it's for the heterosexual persuasion. No, for the heterosexual persuasion, grinder isn't for that. Oh, them. I thought you meant the app was. I was like, it very much wasn't. Can tell it just, we were on the wrong app. I can tell I just woke up. <laughs> I can tell that you're just being thick. <laughs> right, yeah, so Ben... Hounded me. Piss off. Constantly. <laughs> Did I help? Day after day, month oh. after month. Shut <laughs> up. You do video by yourself. <laughs> uh, no, I didn't really. I bet you once. Once, yeah. Just saying, do you, what did you say? Do you want to meet you and your friends to drink? And no. Order at street? No. Oh, I love how you don't even remember. No, I do remember. Oh, my God. You tell no, me. No, I messaged you once, just being like, hey, how are you or something. And then we got chatting, and then we were meant to go on a Sunday to the gym together. Do you don't remember any of this? I thought it was afterwards. No. Okay, so we were meant to do that. However, then on the Saturday night, I was out in town, and you were messaging me, and I was messaging you. I was like, oh, I'm out in town. And you said, oh, I'm coming back from a friend's. I'll stop and meet you for a drink. Oh, right, okay. Yeah, I remember. I remember <laughs> that. Oh, right, okay. Not being funny, but it's for nearly nine years ago. Oh, well, you should. Oh, but you don't remember the day you met the love of your life? Do you? Yes, clearly! The date, no, the date. No, not the date. The date. It was that Saturday. I mean, the... Yeah, but the occasion. Yeah, Saturday. <laughs> no, you don't remember the terms and conditions of the situation. I remember the terms and conditions <laughs> fully. You don't. Met. You don't. Clearly. I, I signed off to these terms and conditions. You didn't. Fairly quickly. Well, for six months. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so that's how we met. Mm. And then six months later, we probably, properly got together after mm. that. Yes. We went to see a Minions on minions. our second date. Yeah. And then we didn't have a third date because we just decided to be friends. So. And, I, and I wanted to dip it and do it. I were, I were new to Manchester. Yeah. I were like, um, what? And we went on two dates and we didn't dip anything or do anything. So don't get started. But I thought, do you know what, this is the one for me, this is what I'm going to marry. But you wanted to just have a little bit of... Yeah, new to Manchester. A few more little appetisers first. New to Manchester, and then I'm like, do you know what, this is ridiculous. Yeah, yeah. and I remember going for lunch with you, or tea with you, or something, and I was like, oh, what have you done today? Like, oh, I've been on two dates. And you're like, girls got to eat. <laughs> like, because you had no money as well, no so you're literally going on dates to I'm get, like... like um, people do this, though, now. People do this. They go on dates just to have something to eat. Uh, but, I ate well, let me just tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> I ate well, I was having cake, burgers, french fries. I was I was eating more than I do now. I was like, yeah, I like that. Well done, man. Um, good for you. Good for me, yeah. Was, and then, it's out, and then you moved in here. I'm not And 
happen. And those were the terms and conditions you signed. <laughs> Don't think I've signed anything. You signed? <laughs> well, we legally signed the terms and conditions. Unfortunately, yeah. Unfortunately. Right, we need to move on to the next question because it's. That's oh, good. okay. Is it quick fire? Well, not quick fire, but I think we've had. Is that enough? Do you want to know more about that? Um, we'll do a part two. Yeah. If, Sorry, I'm very tired. If you want us to elaborate on this, you can let us know. Yeah, we'll have more in comments. Yeah. Yeah. Um, what jobs do you do? Well, darling, if you'd have done this video another day, we wouldn't have, you'd have said nothing. Well, yes, I've got a new job. Um, not telling you where I work, but I'm a financial analyst. very nice part of Manchester that we drove to today just so because my first day is tomorrow so I'll, oh, I'll just go on, we'll just go on a little drive get your bearings got my bearings it's in lovely it's probably the nicest place I've ever worked yeah not nice nice surroundings mm. surroundings are lovely um so it's looking forward to that starting that job tomorrow but I have previously worked at, actually I'm not going to go into what I've previously done <laughs> It's not an interview. I want but, the job. I want this in this video. What What do you do as a job? I work for a charity. And what's your title? Yeah. Do we know what that is yet? Yeah. So you want to reinvent it? Um, I'm the feedback and complaints manager for a charity. It may have something to do with dogs because <laughs> I think we've pretty much said it on the channel. We may have. To. There you go. But it's, yeah, that the lovely places. Mm. Um, One of the best places I've ever worked. It is really like, I love your job. I love hearing about your job. It's the, it's the first job that I actually love hearing about. Oh. Do you know what I mean? All other jobs are like, oh, just, it's superficial stuff, innit? And now it actually means something. It's like, oh, tell me about that. Oh, yeah, I'm interested. I'm not just like, doing potatoes. Oh, right, yeah, interesting. <laughs> doing potatoes. Well, it's normally just stabbing them. But, yeah, you know what I mean. We've done well for ourselves, haven't we? We've done right. Well, yes. We've worked hard for ourselves. We have worked bloody hard. Um, do you have a favourite memory? <laughs> yeah. Is it how we met? <laughs> what, together or is it no, specific My favourite memory is, I suppose it's memories really, just like going to like Disney World with you, getting married. One of my favourite memories is when I booked Disney the first time and you cried. Oh, I cried. <laughs> I literally were it like, was your Christmas present. Mm, I opened one. One present was, I opened it up and it was a Mickey Mouse. I was like, oh, cute. I was like, oh, that's nice. Then I opened up another one. And it was like paperwork. I, I don't know. I couldn't work it out. I thought it was cream. So I was like, oh. And then you're like, oh, we're gonna. Um, no, there's like, oh. Then you went. He knew to Florida. I was proper. Like, <laughs> that's the best present I've ever had. That. <laughs> I was like, oh my god, I couldn't believe it. Oh, that's one of the cutest little memories. Mm -hmm. And then we go again very so shortly. We do. Um, so our wedding was quite a nice memory, I'd say. I said, yeah, I said the wedding, yeah. I don't think you did. No, I said Disney. Playback, the, we <laughs> the wedding. There's three for me, the wedding, Disney, and Mexico honeymoon. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm when... He proposed to me, it was rowing a boat on Central Park River. Um, lake, so what say? River. <laughs> lake. Um, and he proposed to me, and I was like, yeah, of course. Yeah. What are your favourite memories? I don't know. All those things? Some of those. Most of those things. Yeah. yeah just, I just like making little new little adventures. Mm. You like planning things, mm. you know, like holidays and things. Yes. You love a good plan. I've already nearly booked his 40th for next year. I mean, even after your 39th. I know, I'm 39 soon. 40th, I'm going to be like... Uh, you're 41 this year. Yeah, all right. I know, I'm 39. I think we're not looking too bad for his age. No? We're all right. <laughs> Where did you go? We're all right. I think I look alright considering I have a one skin, one step skincare regime and I'll, you have a seventy one step. Yeah, mine's like you hundred step routine. You just go like who spends all the money? 
Well, it depends on what you're spending it on. On the face. Oh, in me, yeah. But, no, but I think I've done better. I think I've done better though with um, creams and things. I used to use 100 pound eye cream, and then I've got that down to 25 pound. Mm. Well done. I'm like, that's ridiculous. Open up was really good. Well done, dude. A lot of it's another topic, but a lot of cream the things you use just throw up there. Hey, up there. Oh, this will be a Happy question. Um, wait, there was a question about cats, I think, on here. Okay. Oh, maybe there wasn't. No. Oh, how many pets do you have? Four. Four. Well, this is one. That's one, Belle. And then we've got Brinley, Bean, and Jesse. Four cats. You have to speak here. Wow. She's so cranky. Are you cranky? Are you cranky? Tell the studio audience, are you cranky? She just sniffed it. But you're happy, aren't you? Is that because you get spoiled? Yeah. Are you spoiled? You spoiled. You're spoiled. grumps. Very soft, that was it. Grumps, though. Very soft. Because you were asleep on my lap and then I made you move to do this. Hmm. <laughs> Um, do you have, oh crap, done that one. How, How old are you both? We've done that. 39 currently, no, 38 currently, going to be 39. 40. 40 currently. 41 and, yeah. You're all right. I'm not embarrassed about that. I'm not embarrassed. You look absolutely gorgeous. Okay. It looks absolutely stunning. <laughs> Every day I'm like, I'm gorgeous. <laughs> you are. Um, what type of music do you both listen to? Radio one, because I'm still younger with it. You listen to radio. <laughs> ben literally knows every song in the top ten. <laughs> you do, because I'll be in car. I'll be in car, and I'll be like, "Who's this?" And you'll be like, "Oh, it's such and such." Ten. He says it on the car. No, but you know, you're like, "Oh, I know what words to it," and, and like, "Who's this?" You're like, "Oh, pigeon detectives." <laughs> Early, early, oh. early 90s, late, late 80s. Like went bar dance. lounge music with no words to it. Yeah. <laughs> or it'll be like jazz. I'm either getting ready and it's like dance music or it's jazz music. Very, it's very odd. Oh, I do like per, a bit of Parisian house music as well. That's funny. Yeah, that well known genre. Yeah, very, very odd. Jesus. Okay. Music's music, isn't it? End of day. Yeah. We went to see Florence and the Machine last year, didn't we? Yes. How did you feel about that? I enjoyed, I enjoyed it. I didn't enjoy standing up, though. No. We're getting into that age where I'm like, because mm. we were, oh, we can sit down, we've got seats. I'm like, oh, great. Sat down, sat down, sat down. She started, everyone got up, went, oh, God, so <laughs> Literally, I had to stand up for the whole thing. I'm like, I can't cope with this. I started throwing paper at these two in front of us, like, sit down. <laughs> Do you remember him and that woman? Yeah, it was literally like a couple. It was literally like this. Yeah. Oh, she's, she's mine. I was like, like all right. Oh, calm down. She weren't even that much to get hold of. Neither of them were. But we were like, next time we go to see it, something like that, we need a, a box or something. I need a cup of tea. I need a blanket. Some ear protectors. Yeah. And we need to get like, we've got tram or not talking ages. We need That's to get just like. Not only, only, but actually, it's not bothered. Actually, it's not bothered. <laughs> We were thinking about seeing Girls of Albert, and it's like... It's very expensive. It's expensive, oh, wow. yeah. I'd rather go on a holiday. Yeah. That's the thing we do, really. We, we'll look, look at getting That's something. That's not... Is, uh, can I ask you a question? Yeah. Where's your favourite holiday destination? That's not Disney, because we talk about that all the time. So where have we been? We've been on holiday. Let me try and remember. Gosh. New York. Disney. Mm. Mexico. Mm. Krakow. Mm. Amsterdam, mm. Berlin, mm. Copenhagen, Copenhagen, Malaga. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure about anything else. Almost died. That's my least favourite place I've been on holiday. Pretty much ever, I think. Mm. I just got food poisoning. You got food poisoning. And James you? pretended he had the symptoms as well <laughs> and started taking some of my medication. I did a few days later. I was like, it's his hotel food. And it was a nice hotel, it's not bad, but it was a lovely hotel. Mm. It wasn't my fault. And the ambulance that came wasn't an ambulance. It, it got touched with a GP surgery, which was something else. 
and then it, that took 45 minutes. I was very good though. In a crisis, you need me in a crisis because I was <laughs> very like. I mean, when I came round the next morning, you were like, Bump that back, I've got a password. Chargers. Yeah. Chargers. Um, all sorts of bits and bobs. I was trekking up to a mountain. <laughs> well, he was on a like on a. Well, what's yeah, a mountain? Mean, oh, trekking up a hill, walking up a hill oh, to find a pharmacy. When it and wasn't it, like I was just sat there in a spa. I was sat there with a drip in me. I was in it a pair. Out all my orifices. I was in a pair of brand new Jimmy shoes. I'm not bothered. That was your trekking up shoe some mountain choice. without a road, a path. We trucks and everything flying past me. I thought this is how I'm gonna die. Right, as I was dying. Well, I was. <laughs> Where's your favourite holiday place that we've been out of all of them? It's difficult. Mexico for relaxing. Oh, right. okay. City break. I really liked Copenhagen. Yeah. That's somewhere I could see myself living. Huh? What about you? Yeah, I like Copenhagen. Okay. Um, yeah, I like New York. It's busy. I like New York, and I like Copenhagen, and I love Berlin. Mm. Is it weird, didn't you think of New York straight away? That you didn't? Mm. I like New York. No, it's fine. It's fine. Um, but we're going to book another little Monday to Friday. So oh, Budapest. Budapest. We're going to book another Monday to Friday mm. somewhere later in the year, like September. Mm. So if anyone's got any recommendations for a nice Monday to Friday that we haven't said. Mm. I like the idea of Lisbon. I know, I'm slightly. I don't wherever. know why, but it's just meant to be quite nice. I'll just go wherever, go wherever mate. Yeah, you'll go wherever I book. Because <laughs> you can't be bothered, wouldn't you? No, it's not that I do look, but I'm like. You're really good at finding hotels and things. Like, I'll find motels and travel and everything. It's like, you find really good things. Yeah. I know. Yeah, You've got more experience than anything. Barcelona we've been. Oh, Barcelona. Oh, God, we've been everywhere. Did I book that? Uh, did I sort that one out? You did something. I don't know. I can't remember. Or was that the holiday where it was like I booked it that you planned everything when we were there? Yes. Including walking from basically the beach to the biggest, up the biggest, steepest hill. Probably about an hour and a half in the scorching heat, walking parallel to a tram. <laughs> I didn't but realize. no one re reviewed, like, no one planned for public transport, no. did they? No, I did, but I thought, oh, it's not far, come on. Nice day. I was <laughs> absolutely like, oh. Rotten. But didn't like Barcelona, Something right? in me like, I'm not getting transport. Didn't like that. Because I've not planned it. Hmm. Oh, God. I didn't like Barcelona. Yeah, didn't but like I won't go back to Barcelona because there's nothing to do. No. We aren't bragging, sorry about these, it's just places no. where we've been. Um, just gone off at a tangent then. Yeah. Have you done, I don't even know if you've done any of them questions, I just, I don't know why, what did I just ask you? Where oh, yeah. Favourite holiday yeah. or something. Um, how long have you been married? So it's going to be six years this May. So it's going to be nine years together in December. Nine years together, six years married. Stop playing with that pen, love. Stop playing with that pen. No. Oh, Jesse, come on, pull her off. Um, oh. Yeah, six years in May. Yes, six years in May. And this is actually true. <laughs> ben hasn't paid me to say this, but I always think. Pays <laughs> to do many things, though. I, I hope that when we die, we meet again. I always think, oh, I hope when there's an, if there's another life after this, I hope like. We find each other again. Okay. Coming back as a cat, two feral cats. Because it took me 30 <laughs> years to find you, which is a bit. I'm like, oh. Think about what fun we could have had when I was young. Oh, I know, I think that as well. But then I think, have we met before? Think of all the frogs we kissed to meet our little prince. No, I kissed a few. You kissed a lot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I should have. Some of them. Um, do you have any hobbies? Well, I like going to gym every day. That's, is that a hobby? That's a hobby. Playing the first Yeah, we've got a cat on do. Show on. Oh, I don't know if he's stirring. So you can see the blanket moving. Oh, you can. A little bit. Oh. 
I don't know if you can. I don't know if I can see that. You can see his little ginger bum there. Hello. Hey, hey, oh. <laughs> oh. Let's get this little stand. Yeah, it's cute. We've got a new phone, a uh, new stand for the holiday. So, what? Who is it now? Um, what were you, what were you asking? Hobbies. So, like, yeah, you like going to the gym. Going to gym. I go to the gym. Yeah. I wouldn't say it's a hot, well, I suppose it is a hobby, but I don't really. What hobbies? Like cycling, running, all that stuff. <laughs> <laughs> They're just sports. <laughs> yeah, but hobbies. We like I like watching football. Playing on PlayStation. Watching football. Football. Playing on Football Manager on the computer. Mm. Playing PlayStation games. Mm -hmm. um, I hate it when people put things on like CDs or like on things like, my hobbies are catching up with friends. That's not a hobby, that's just a choice. Yeah. That's that, wouldn't, that wouldn't be on mine. Going um, shopping. Yeah, shopping. Eating. No, that's, you just need that to survive. Yeah. <laughs> Eating out and things like that. <laughs> I, I wouldn't call it, yeah, I wouldn't call them hobbies. I'd just call them decisions you make one day. Mm. Yeah. But yeah, hobbies are like computer games and things. We do love a computer game. Yeah. We've, we've just got... The new Avatar game at the moment, which I'm yeah. thinking about selling, yeah, because I'd sell it because it's just like... I don't know. I think I it's know. like CES. Yeah, I get 25 smell in there. I, I know, 25 quid I get for that. Oh, get it. Mm. You, you didn't cost you anything anyway. I'd like for free, yeah. Yeah. Well, I'd sell it and use it for something else, so 25 quid, yeah. It's just the riffraff that you've got to be around. Yeah. Apologies if anybody goes in there, it's just it's not real our aesthetic. Yeah. Um, Favourite TV show? We'll say it after three. Am I supposed to know that? Yeah. Think of the best, the best what, you're just going to say the TV shows. No, Bob's Burgers. Oh, oh right. Well, Bob's it's not Burger. my favourite TV show. Oh, is it not? No. Oh. <laughs> I thought you were going to say Bob's Burgers. I mean, it's it's something I enjoy watching. I wouldn't say it's my favourite TV What's your favorite? show. I don't know. I don't think I have a favourite TV show. Something. If somebody said, right, you've got to watch this, this is the only thing you can watch for the rest of your life, what would it be? Oh. What would I watch? I don't know. I'd see Bob's Burgers on Friends. Oh. Okay. I Simpsons. mean, it's on. There's a lot of episodes of Simpsons, I think that's good. At least it is your one. Yeah. You're more into cartoons than me. Mm. But yeah, Bob's Burgers is fun. So are Office Sets. Mm. And The Great North. We like cartoons. Mm. And then? I like things like. 24, mm. Game of Thrones, House of the Dragon, mm. The Last of Us, mm. Train You, mm. so and so and so. <laughs> Wide variety of things. Yeah, Glow Up. Glow Up. Anything gay? Uh, drag Race. Drag, oh, Drag UK Race. Yes, so. Drag Race. I love Drag Race. I'm very into Maddie Morphosis at the moment, if anybody knows who that is. <laughs> it's a straight drag queen. Drag queen is straight. <laughs> yeah. he, he, he does a little like a little like podcast TV show thing on YouTube, and Joe was watching it for about four or five episodes, and the, the name of it's called "Give It to Me Straight" because mm. he's straight. And you hadn't realised. Well, I didn't actually. even know he was straight drag queen until like I told you. You told me. I was like, what? <laughs> but then it did make sense because like you seem very butch, but I'm like, he's not that. He but, can be. Yeah. Well, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Laddie. Yeah. Um. Oh, we're never done. Do you want any... Oh, this is the last question. What? Do Do you want any children? <laughs> After three. One, two, three. Never. No. No. no never. Ever. ever. No, thank you. Not going to happen. Slam the door, close the windows, sh sh close the blinds. Up, it's never happening. No. no. We are far too into ourselves and having a... No, that sounds really selfish. I just don't want a child. No, but we're wearing. I don't into, want a kid. Yeah, but we're into like traveling the world, seeing the yeah, world. Don't we want don't a kid. want anything to hold us back. And if there's people that do that and have kids, I'm like, I don't know where you get energy from. No. But we're just like, we know what we want. No. We'll get a dog in a few years and that's about it. Yeah. Not, like, a, not child. a child. Never. Not never, ever, ever. No, thank you. And if, I, if we have children, my under eye, gone. <laughs> eye creams, don't bother. No. We'll go put all our speed in it, bath in it. Oh no. Not for us. Not for me. 
Not a picture. That sad little get to know us Q&A. If there's any questions I want to ask you. Oh, what, what is your favourite food? Broccoli. I go for about a, a bulb of broccoli every day. Um, if there's one food I'd tweet, like your death row meal. Okay. Favourite food? It would be sushi. Oh. I love soup. Even I don't. I rarely eat it, but I love it. What What's your favourite? Potatoes. <laughs> yeah. What any any type of potato? Be like, oh, I love that. You've got crisps. Mm -hmm. You've got um, new potatoes, jacket potatoes. Hang on, new potatoes, raised potatoes, mashed potato, jacket potato, Crickets. sweet potato, sweet um, jacket potato. Wow. Potato croquettes, potato waffles, fries, curly fries, wedges, um, crisps, no potato. So it's like, uh, there's more than this. Dauphinois potatoes. What's Dauphinois? They're like layered with like cheese and stuff. All that oh, okay. They're little Hasselback potatoes where they've got little lines in them. Um, what else is there? Okay, Mrs. B loves potatoes so much. I've started doing well. And potato and a condiment. Uh, you look. When I first met him, all that were in his fridge were condiments. So I was like, right, this ain't happening. I think we need to change this. I think we know far too much. Yeah. Um, but yeah, that is the... short sat down there like that. <laughs> well, we're very much in green. No, we are. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, subscribe, comment. Oh, we'll get the cat. Um, get the bell. And if there's anything else you want to know, put it in the comments. We'll yeah. either do a part two or we'll just answer it in the comments. Yeah, well, <laughs> depends on how many of this. And if, apologies if we've not answered your question. Sometimes that's just how life is. Yeah. <laughs> that's it. So uh, have, a, have a lovely rest of your day, your week, your month, your year, whatever you're doing. And uh, toodaloo. Bye bye.